Hello friends, today we will discuss a topic on ARQ that is the error correction method for the data transmission that uses an acknowledgement message sent by the receiver indicating that it has been correctly received a data frame or packet from sender to receiver and timeouts means within a fixed time so we will start a automatic repeat request it is a technique used to ensure that a data is delivered to receiver or destination without any error that it's indicating that that is an error correction method that is provide the transmission of data from sender to receiver that is the sender that is the receiver now sender send a data frame packet we should know the terms frame packet and data when the data or message started from the top layer that is known as the data when it comes on the network layer that is known as the packet that include the source at ip address and destination ip address that is known as the packet and the frame that is converted in the packet into the onto the data link layer that is known as the frame format that is that includes the trailer means for the error correction method so here we are just focusing on a particular term that is known as the frame from sender to receiver that is known as the ARQ how the sender is sending a frame from source to destination without any without any error so here the main important thing the signification of ARQ is that to transmission of the end frame from sender to receiver error free means how are we going to transmit a data from sender to receiver without any error so that is the main concept of ARQ now we will discuss about the what are the techniques or what are the classification of the ERQ so that is the definition of ERQ over the network here we can understand the definition of that particular thing ERQ is that how the sender sending a frame over a network to the receiver without any error because all the transmission is going to be on the over the network so that is the main concept of the ARQ means how can we deliver the data from sender to receiver without any error so that is the actual concept or that is the significance of the automatic repeat request now we will discuss the classification of classification of or the techniques used in ARQ yeah maybe say the methods used in ARQ or classification you can classification
so there are the four types of the four method or classification first one is first second third and fourth first one is stop and bait protocol and the second is sliding window protocol and the third one is the go back and ARQ and the last one is selective repeat ARQ so that is the classification of ARQ or methods that is used in the ARQ we will discuss in the next slides so here we will we are focusing on the stop and bait protocol sliding window protocol go back and ARQ and the selective ARQ here in the in another word we can say stop and bait protocol ARQ also so don't confuse what is the meaning of the stop and bait protocol ARQ and sliding window protocol of ARQ we can also known as the we can say that is the also sliding window protocol ARQ go back and ARQ and selective repeat ARQ because all the four terms are comes under the automatic repeat request so that is the error correction methods or how to deliver the data from sender to receiver without any error so in that four types of the technique we have to ensure that the error free transmission from sender to receiver thank you for watching this video for more videos kindly subscribe the channel thank you